Hi guys, my name is Alice and today we're gonna talk about Aeromancer class. Aeromancer is a relatively new class. Smilegate labeled Aeromancer as a synergy DPS supportive DPS. They don't have the highest ceiling but they're very practical, consistent and prefer in many raid lobbies. We'll go over what Aeromancer does and how they work so you guys have some idea whether you should use your next Hyper Express on her or not. Winnie Fury, the Swiftness variant, has good stagger and weak point contribution. Drizzle, the Spec variant, has poor weak point but fine stagger contribution. Aeromancer has 10% crit synergy and both of class specs can maintain 100% uptime without much effort. On top of that, Wind Fury Aeromancer can also provide additional attack speed and movement speed for the team and an additional 10% crit synergy from the Flush Awakening. How the identity works Decreases boss attack damage Just massive AoE like a mini betrayal set Improves depending on your class engraving What does class engravings do? Drizzle, the spec variant all of your weather skills get stronger when your identity is activated, similar to Igniter. You usually use this awakening since it generates gauge and does more damage. A scorching Sun and Sweeping Wind are your main damage skills. Winifrey Galwin Swiftness Variant Identity area size becomes smaller. It doesn't decrease boss attack damage anymore, but it gives allies 12% attack speed and movement speed instead. We need Raid Captain and Kimble Weapon in one class engraving. We don't have to use Kimble Weapon because of this. Storm Drill and this Demon Slayer Slash are Wind Fury's main damage skill. Other Combat Engravings Scratch and Hit Master are a must for both class engraving. Most of players run level 3 adrenaline as well, but it can be optional for Drizzle. Wind Fury usually runs Scratch, Class, Raid Captain, Hit Master, and Adrenaline. Drizzle usually runs Scratch, Class, Emblem Weapon, Hit Master, and Adrenaline. Their plus one engraving option is usually either Predator, but however, you can also go Awakening One if you're a Swift variant and use Dominion Relic Set for better uptime. You can also go Cursal 3 plus Adrenaline 1 instead of Adrenaline 3 as Drizzle if you want higher ceiling with less consistency unless you raid with at least one more crit synergy in the same group. Combat Stats and Relic Sets Winifury Winifury has a lot of variations in their Relic Set options and also Combat Stats distribution. Three most known Relic Set options are 6 Hallucination, 6 Dominion, and 6 Nightmare. Six Hallucination is what Saint Don plays. You might have watched him playing. This gives you very reliable crit and doesn't really have up and down in their performance. But it has lowest ceiling and becomes an extreme mana hunger build. Six Dominion technically has the highest ceiling but it doesn't perform well in farm contents just like other Swiftness classes. Still an extreme mana hunger build and inconsistent with crit. Six Nightmare has the best burst out of the all Wind Fury variants. Swiftness is still your secondary combat stat, but it is slower than other variants. Performs better in burst-friendly environments. On top of relic sets, you also need to decide how many spenders and how many weather skills you want to use. Playstyle will differ based on your choice. I'll maybe introduce those in another video. Drizzle Drizzle is a heavy spec class. Spec helps your identity gain and also damage. Your main identity generator makes massive gauge, even with lower spec. So their spec have one of the highest scalers in the game. So spec equals damage. Drizzle must go hallucination to make Kimblem weapon work. They only have their own crit synergy which is 10% as crit chance modifier. So you need adrenaline and hallucination for the lack of crit. Play stealth and quick rotations. Wind Fury is a burst damage in a spender style with low cooldown. You need to use your prep skill, then use the spenders to pop it. Drizzle is an overtime damage in a gauge style with high cooldown. You need to fill up your gauge before your main damage skill comes back on cooldown, and dump everything during your identity. Required collectibles Wind Fury Wind Fury is a mana hunger class, so you need to use Focus and Conviction Judgment runes. Also, Conviction Judgment is required if you want to run Dominion Relic Set. 
Drizzle Drizzle needs at least 2 and up to 3 wealth runes for the optimal gameplay. Ideally, you want to have Conviction Judgment as well for mana and also some CDR since it is extremely easy to proc, but it can be replaced with Focus and just give up the CDR part. Thank you for watching, make sure to check the video in the description and you can also come to Lost Boy stream if you have any questions. My name is Alice and you can follow me on Twitch as well. Bye guys!